Okay, panel, we'll go one question at a time. You have three minutes. Face law prevails, and we'll start with Arlene Francis. Claire? Oh, excuse me. Are you a, uh, an actor or an actress? Not primarily, no. Mm. Was that no? Yeah. No. Soupy? She's not an actress or an actor? No. no. Are you a singer? Yes. Joyce? Uh, are you in a television series? No. Jean? Um, you're a singer. Are you appearing in New York City at the present time, my dear? No. Arlene? Are you a, um, are you an opera singer? No. Soupy? Are you a nightclub recording singer? Yes. Joyce? Uh, do you have an album out at present time? Yes. Jean? Are you a single rather than a member of a group? Yes. Arlene? Are you... Here goes Fate's Law. Are you Helen O'Connell? That's no. right. There went Fate's Law. Okay, That's Arlene, right. you're out. And super are you, is your album, like, are you a top 40 singer? Or are you, like, from the good old days? <laughs> How can you answer yes or no to that? That's an either or. Soupy? Hello. Both. You want to rephrase it? <laughs> oh, oh, both. 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 Uh, both. Uh, 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 okay. Joyce? Are you primarily known for rock and roll? No. Jean? Do you also play the instrument? Like, do you sing? Do you play the piano when you sing? No. Uh, Soupy? Um, I are, think this are you a blonde? <laughs> Today. <laughs> Joyce? Oh, anyway. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to pass. Okay, G he passes. Jean? So we're just about out of time, so do you want to make a guess? I don't think anybody's near it. I think is she's it, fooled you entirely. Is it Patty Page? No, she no. just used her own voice, and <laughs> Teresa Brewer has baffled you <laughs> entirely. <laughs> I really did, and I, and it, what was so funny, because we did a Mike Douglas show together, and I thought it was you, but like, I never hear you talk that way. You always go, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, right? Really, that, and your album is great. It, Thank you. I hear it Thank all you. the time. She has two albums that are out now. One is Teresa Brewer, and Music, 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 which is a goodie, and the other one I heard part of, in all of all places, in St. Thomas, the songs of Bessie Smith. Teresa Brewer and Count Basie and Thad Jones. Was that fun to make that album? Oh, again? just great. I enjoyed it so much. And they, I could do an album with Duke Ellington, too, next week. Now, that's, that's a, a, a group that I would not imagine you to sing with. How did that happen? Uh, my husband, Bob Thiel, thought of it. That's a wild idea. What are you going to do on it? Oh, most of his hits, um, you ain't, it, ain't, it, doesn't, it don't mean a thing if you ain't got that swing and rug cutter. It's so good to have somebody who sings the songs I remember, because I don't remember the ones that were just written. I really don't. That's what I was talking about. Yeah. She gives them her own interpretation, which is so Oh, she's wonderful. dynamite. You and you know what? It's so wild, thing. because in her big hit that's all over again, music, 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 they never change the words to one thing, and they say, put another nickel in, and you know you can't play box <laughs> any place but nickel. <laughs> that's true. That certainly is true. I'm, you know, the same guy who wrote Ricochet Romance, which was a big record for her, was the lyricist for The Man of La Mancha. Did you know that? Really? I yeah. didn't know that. Joe Darian. You see, here it is. You learned something, and it's already yes. <laughs> about a quarter to. Thank you for being with us, Teresa. Come back and play with us. <laughs>